In this video, I will show you how to remove red wine from a carpet using just talc powder. Commercially available baby powders or body powders from any brand are fine. This is a dry and fast method. In about 10 to 15 minutes, the carpet will be clean and dry. The wine smell will be gone. Let's do some damage. Remove as much wine as possible with a towel. When no more wine transfers to the towel, drop talcum powder on the stain and agitate it to go deep into the fibers. Talc is much better absorbent than the carpet fibers, so the remaining wine will transfer to the powder. But for that, a quite significant quantity of talc powder will be necessary, and it must be seriously agitated and pressed to reach deep under the surface. Remove the stained powder with the vacuum cleaner. Both wet and dry types of vacuum cleaners can be used, a big advantage of this method. Depending on the wine quantity, carpet density and color, the process must be repeated a number of times. When the carpet looks almost fine, apply a big quantity of powder, press it very seriously with the hand and even with the foot until a compact mass of it goes deep inside, filling the area entirely. Wait at least 10 minutes. During this time, the remaining liquid will be absorbed by the talc powder, leaving the carpet dry. Now, remove all the powder. Be aware that talc powder puts extra stress on the dry type vacuum cleaners, the filters are likely to clog quickly. This is the result after 10 minutes. While the carpet is mostly clean, a very faint stain is actually visible. However, you can achieve better results with a little more effort. On purpose, I used a very small towel in the first cleaning phase to show you a typical and realistic result for a medium effort and time spent. Especially when you have something better to do with the rest of the wine and the rest of the night, this might be just fine.